This is a patient who presented with a new mole on his right abdomen that was present for several weeks and was rapidly changing in color. The lesion looked suspicious, so a biopsy was performed, which revealed a melanoma in situ. Melanoma in situ is the earliest stage of melanoma and is completely curable with surgical excision. Once the, we have the biopsy result, the patient returns to the office for excision of the melanoma. The area is numb with a local anesthetic, and the area is prepped with an antiseptic prior to starting the surgical excision. The patient is made comfortable, and we begin the excision under local anesthetic. Here you can see the lesion being excised. Of the three most common types of skin cancer, melanoma is the least common, but the most deadly. Early detection is imperative to treatment of these lesions. That means that if a melanoma is found early, like it was in this case, it can be surgically excised with a 100% cure rate and with no need for additional treatments, such as chemotherapy, radiation, or any other workup or testing. As a lesion is excised, we then sew the patient up with two layers of stitches, one underneath the skin and one layer on top. The layer underneath the skin will dissolve on its own, and the layer on top will be removed in two weeks when the wound is fully healed and the patient returns for suture removal. When we talk about melanomas, we talk about the ABCDEs of abnormal moles. This mnemonic helps us understand and recognize abnormal moles. A stands for asymmetry. B stands for irregular borders. C stands for more than one color. D, a diameter bigger than 6 millimeters, which is about the size of a pencil eraser. And the most important one, in my opinion, is E, which is evolution, a mole that is changing in any way, or new. If you have a mole that meets one or more of these criteria, it is important to have the mole tested. Additionally, we recommend annual skin examinations by a board-certified dermatologist in order to be able to catch these abnormal moles and possible melanomas early and to lead to definitive treatment and no harm to one's health. Here we see the wound completely closed. Patient is still very comfortable. A pressure dressing will be applied. The patient will give, be given instructions on how to take care of the wound at home, and we'll see the patient back in two weeks. During this time, we generally recommend no heavy lifting or exercise in order to make sure the wound heals as well as possible and to prevent any possible risks of infection or opening up of the wound. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.